Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today is the first video of our Barakpur series. Uh, Barakpur series ha uh, will have some more videos and this is the history of Barakpur. So today I will talk about this town in West Bengal which is very near Kolkata with a very rich history in our Indian heritage. The city lies in North 24 Parganas district. This is Barakpur. Many of you know Barakpur for its foodies hub. But this place has a very very rich history. So we know Barakpur for Dada Bodhi Biryani. Some other biryanis like Dibapi Biryani and also Aminia, Arsalan and so many other eateries which are present in the city. Barakpur had its name as Chanak previously. But the British loved this city so much that they made this city as the origin of the first cantonment of the East India Company. So the name Barakpur came from the English word barracks since the 1772. The barracks was formed in the year 1772 by the British Raj. Barakpur was the administrative and the military base of the British Raj. This city also has a very beautiful scenic landscape with the river Hooghly flowing in the heart of the city. With its beautiful scenic backdrop, Barakpur was a famous vacation retreat for the British officials. The serene river view from the city made them feel close to England. Barakpur turned into Little Calcutta. Barakpur has the grave of the Lady Charlotte Canning. Lady Charlotte Canning was the first viceroy of India. Lady Canning is famous for the popular sweet Lady Kenny, which was formulated by Bhim Chandranag, made specially for her. This is the statue of the Lord Canning installed beside the grave of Lady Canning. Other than these, there are many British bungalows and other official buildings which are still to be seen in the cantonment area and Lat Bagan of Barakpur. Barakpur had two major revolts which were in 1824 and 1857. The Barakpur Mutiny of 1824 under the leadership of the Bindi Tiwari the Sepoy of 47th Regiment of Bengal Native Infantry. They refused to parade on November 1st, 1824. This led to a terrible violent outcome and bloodshed. Sepoy Bindi Tiwari with his brethren from the 26th and the 62nd Regiment revolted. To one shock, the British attacked them with cannons to punish them for their act of insubordination. The sepoys tried to defend themselves with their guns which were not loaded as they did not aim for bloodshed. The Ganges nearby saw many sepoys to drown in futile act of saving their lives. Another very famous revolt which took place in Barakpur was the Sepoy Mutiny of 1857 led by Sepoy of 34th Bengal Native Infantry Mangal Pandey. This could be the immediate cause of revolt of 1857 and might be described as a first struggle towards the war of independence. There were fears that the cartridges of the rifle the sepoys used contained grease made from fats of cows and pigs which was offensive to both the Hindus and Muslims. Thus the sepoys revolted, led by Mangal Pandey in 1857 in Barakpur who was later executed in Barakpur and this place has a memorial built for Mangal Pandey. Thus, Barakpur has a very enriching history and I am sure one visit to this place will revive you of all the historical events as you can still see the British establishments in Barakpur. This was our first video in the Barakpur series as the history of Barakpur. I will be coming up with many more videos in this series with Barakpur as the current state and the cantonment areas and the buildings which you can see now. 
If you like the video, please subscribe to my channel and also share this video and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching the full video.